Good morning, guys. It is day three of me knitting an old whip. This is the balloon sweater by Petite Knit, and I finished the body yesterday. Okay. This looks, <laughs> this looks crazy. This looks so nice. Oh my gosh. Okay, first of all, I did not realize the collar would be so <laughs> okay. Like, I love it though because it's different from my other sweaters. It's just weird. <laughs> But yeah, I'm very excited. I love the silhouette of this sweater. Like it's going to be so nice for like going out to nice places. You know, it's that type of sweater, which is why I didn't like knit it to be super oversized or anything because I did want it to be more like a nice date night type going out sweater instead of more of a relaxed wear everyday type of sweater, you know? So Anyway, this looks so good, and I'm going to start a sleeve today. I don't have a goal. I'm just going to knit. That's it. Guys, okay, so when is this video coming out? I don't know, but anyway, I'm over here. I haven't even... I started picking up stitches for my sleeves, but there's a test knit. I know I said no more test knits, but this one is different, okay? There's a test knit that I want to sign up for and that I want to knit, like I want to knit this sweater badly, okay? I'm literally bumping whatever sweater I have planned so that I can knit that, okay? And I'm really hoping Kalila wants to knit it as well. Like we're literally bumping a project so we can knit that. So I'm hoping, <clears throat> ah! I'm hoping that we get it. So I'm already planning out my color palette for it and everything. It's literally, if you guys know me, you know I like to put anything together and just make it in my own, you know, any colors. But this one specifically, so I had all of this Akatar yarn from 2021 when I got it when Red Door Fiber Studio came out with it and I bought the entire collection. I bought all the colors, <laughs> okay? And I've used some over the past couple of years for a couple of sweaters and it's been so great but I had a lot of single skeins as well and I still have I still have tons oh my gosh I have a bunch that I didn't include in this color palette but I think I know what I'm gonna be going with and the sweater has a bunch of colors in it so let me show you what I have so far so this will be I don't I wouldn't need all of this but I just have all of this I have a sweater quantity so this will be the main color of everything okay the main color and then these colors will be all of the other colors that I'll be using so this is the palette guys and this is like the leftover Akatar yarn and then other yarns but anyway yeah so this is the whole thing I love it because it's like moody I got the variegated and tonal versions of each other. I don't even know if these are the versions of each other, honestly. Either way, I separated it though, because these go to go together well, these go together well, these go together well. But I was like, I separated it because I don't want the colors close. Like I want it to be a nice funky sweater. So very excited, hoping I get it. Just wanted to show you guys this. <laughs> All right guys, I picked up my stitches. It's kind of loud. All right, I picked up my stitches for my sleeve. I hate picking up stitches, oh my gosh. This is why I love raglan, because my stitches are already there and I just have to pick up a few stitches. I'm fine with picking up like five, six, seven stitches, okay? Rather than however many stitches I picked up for this. Like, oh, drop shoulder, you'll be the death of me. But, it's fine. It's fine. So it is time. Ooh, that was a good laugh. Hold on. I'm watching FP1. That was a good laugh. Woo! Finally. Anyway, yeah. So hate picking up stitches, but I finally have all the stitches picked up. And now it's just stocking it until I get to the cuff. Ah, exciting. Uh, I love when I have my stitches on my needles. I'm like, finally, <laughs> I'm like the sleeve stitches. I'm like, finally, let's knit, guys. Uh, anyway, that's it.
update on the sleeve. Let's put these on because we have progress. So this is what the sleeve is looking like. This looks crazy. Like this drop shoulders are raglans are so superior. <laughs> anyway, so this is the sleeve and I measured how many rounds I knit per inch and the total was like 91 rounds so I'm counting it I am on round 30 out of 91 I plan on staying up tonight it's currently 5 13 p.m. so we continue <music> almost midnight and I want to stay up but honestly I am so sleepy and I just want to dream do you guys ever just like sometimes like control your dream I control my dream sometimes like pre-dreaming and then I get to control it and like do a little oh my battery's dying anyway I just want to daydream with my eyes closed in bed okay <laughs> where I'm controlling the dream and stuff all right guys I just want to go to sleep. Okay, so I'm done for tonight. It's almost midnight. And this is my progress for today. All right, the battery died. Anyway, I was showing you guys <laughs> my progress for today. This is insane. Being a sleeve like this makes me like, <laughs> but you know, it's a balloon sleeve. So uh, there's a first for everything. This is so crazy, guys. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. It looks insane. I still love raglans better, but this is going to be so fun. So I have like three and a half inches left in it before I get to the ribbing. And then I like rapidly, rapidly decrease for that skinny cuff. And it's so weird it's gonna be so weird but it's gonna be so fun because it's gonna be so different from what I've done before so anyway that's it for today gonna get more progress tomorrow gonna try and finish the sleeve tomorrow and start the next sleeve and then I'll be done with the whip guys <laughs> this is so exciting I'm gonna be done with a whip oh my gosh like finally oh anyway that's it for today's video I'll see you guys in the next one